haze is getting clearer and brighter as NASA's Dawn spacecraft closes in. But the debate about its status as a planet is still cloudy. New pictures from the spacecraft show two mysterious bright spots on Ceres. Scientists don't know what they are, but they expect to learn a lot more as Dawn begins orbiting the small world. Ceres was intriguing for astronomers long before Dawn was launched in 2007 on a mission to explore it. Here are some details. It was called a planet when it was first discovered in 1801. It was the first object discovered in our solar system's main asteroid belt. 19th century astronomers couldn't be sure if Ceres was round, so it was demoted to an asteroid. In 2006, it was reclassified a dwarf planet, like Pluto. A dwarf planet? What does that even mean? The group that came up with the phrase, the International Astronomical Union, says a dwarf planet is a round object that orbits the sun in a path that doesn't have a lot of stuff in it. Ceres is in the asteroid belt, so it has lots of company. Pluto is in the Kuiper belt, a region NASA says probably has hundreds of thousands of icy bodies. But many astronomers and small planet fans don't agree with the classification. Like Vanderbilt University astronomy professor David Weintraub, he says that when Dawn shows us close-up images of Ceres, we'll realize that even though it's small, Ceres is what he calls a beautiful, magical, mysterious world. Pluto, by the way, will be visited by the New Horizons probe in July. And the professor thinks that after that, scientists will change their mind about dwarf planets. He says it's silly to pretend that a dwarf planet isn't a planet. It's still a planet, just a little one.